Well, I just got home a little while ago and I thought my day was over after uh, sending those two ducks to a... Uh, honestly, it's a wonderful place. Uh, fucking Betty decided, hey, I'm gonna fucking uh, run away. So now I have to go find a fucking dog because Betty decided to uh, run away. Can you do me a favor and stop listening to the baseball game so we can find the dog? Please. I true. I don't. I don't know where she's at. I already walked across the road and everything looking for her, but I don't know. I decided to go and get the camera so then you guys are kind of on the same page here, so you're not asking a week from now where's the dog if we don't find her. I'm upset, but it's not the first time she's done this. But you know, the chickens are in chicken jail because they've been doing chicken shenanigans. They've been pooping on everything. It's just one of those fucking days. It could be like multiple things at this point. Oh, fucking spider web. Fuck. Like, it can be multiple things. Like, she's either somewhere around here screwing off, which she usually doesn't do, or she's at like a neighbor's house somewhere eating their trash. Or she's at a neighbor's house eating steak. Yes, that's happened before. She's gone over to someone's house. They thought she was a stray. Brought her in and started feeding her steak. Apparently. So, um... I don't know. Betty! And I mean, the only reason why I'm kind of in like a joking mood about this is like, one, it's my defense mechanism. And two, it's not the first time she's done it. So, why freak out when she's going to be back in like not even an hour because she's out running the fucking neighborhood? And I, I don't know. It's just one of those fucking days. Betty, you little wank stain, where are you? I guess let's continue the search for Betty. Allie's out getting food at the moment. So, is that a, that's a big motherfucking spider web I almost jumped in. Those of you that actually took time out of your day to watch this, how, mu how many of you want to bet that before people even click on this, they're like, click me, click me, click me. Jerry, quiet down and help me find the dog. Don't give me that. You know exactly what I'm looking for. You hit her, didn't you? Yeah, you did. Well, I'm gonna do like a quick run through of the house one more time before I decide to leave the house to look for her because one time we thought she ran off and she was under the damn couch because you know, fucking dogs. Well, uh, she's not in the house, which means uh, she's somewhere out in fucking La La Land. And I don't know if you guys know this, La La Land is a big land. So it looks like we're gonna have to get in the car. Well, we had we had some random car stop, brake, reverse, turn around, and drive away really fast. And uh, it could be someone that saw the dog, or it could be someone that figured out where we live because someone posted where we live. So, yeah, you never can know these days, huh? And I know I, re I I know I really like joked about the whole like you guys found out where I live thing, but in all honesty, uh, we ordered cameras and we ordered two guns. So I mean like. If someone manages to find their way over, please don't come over here, but if you do, and I guess if you're really nice, you can live, but if you come at like midnight and try to get in the house, you're gonna you're gonna get shot and you're gonna get blown in half. So uh, I wouldn't do that. So I, I'm waiting for Allie to get back so like we can like, one of us can look and one of us can drive. Uh, she's not back yet, but Betty still hasn't shown up, but nobody has come by with her yet. This damn dog, dude. I mean, we could do an invisible fence thing, but, like, if you put a collar on her, like, she just starts freaking out and she won't move. And, I mean, we tried getting her used to it, but it never worked. So, what are you, what are you going to do? And it's honestly super annoying. I'm getting tired of it. And, like, someone's always bringing that damn dog back. And it's, like, it's not like we just leave her out and, goodbye, Betty. It's, like, you're with her. You turn around to do something, you turn back around and the dang dog's gone. So, and I mean, I've had her forever. So, it's just, what do you fucking know? The title of the video, Betty ran off or Betty's fucking missing. Peggy, hey, come on. Hey, come on, we're gonna go find your sister, Peggy. Come on, let's go, bye-bye. Come on, you wanna go, bye-bye? Come on, let's go, bye-bye. Come on, bye-bye, 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 bye-bye. We're gonna go find your sister. So Allie is driving, I'm here with the dog, she's sh like upset obviously, and uh, yeah, here we go, we're gonna go down the road and back looking for this freaking dog who decided to run off. Betty, you little shit, where are you? Betty, oh, it would be okay, it'll be okay. Basically what happened was my mom came over while we weren't here, and she let she let the dogs out and I think she only let one in so Betty wandered off that's what I kind of picked up so far 
So she couldn't have gone this far. She yeah, because she's been out for a hot fucking minute. I I didn't notice her earlier, like, but I figured she was just fucking off somewhere in the house because Peggy was in the house, but. Well, the good news is, look how beautiful it is out, and there's an ugly bastard with the camera right there. A sad dog right here, and uh, another ugly bastard. Betty, you little shit, where the fuck are you? You're not up there, you're not rich enough. Don't worry, we're gonna find your sister unless she got eaten by a raccoon. And if she got eaten by a raccoon, well then we're kinda screwed, but I'm joking, I don't think she got eaten by a raccoon. Stop being so freaking sensitive. Well, we're still looking. We're on our way back through. We still have to go all the way down and then all the way back. Allie, our security stuff arrives tomorrow. I told I told them on the vlog today that if anybody gets, shows up like with like Mal and Ten, they're gonna get shot in half. Uh -huh. Yeah, you, you will you will die if you come over. Just wanna let you know that. Uh, it's not really a threat, it's a promise. Oh Brennan, it's me! You shouldn't talk to any of your fans. Yeah, but if we give an open invitation to people to come over, you know how that fucking turns out, okay? You've seen the other shit people do to people that get doxxed. So I really don't want to get doxxed, which I already got doxxed. So now I have to protect myself. And, you know, somebody's going to show up at midnight. And if you show up at midnight, you're going to die. I think that's pretty fair to say. There she is. Stop. Oh. Okay, so someone found her. She made it really far. He's put he was putting out signs for her and I just ran into him So we're gonna follow him there Peggy Peggy. We found your sister. Well, he found your sister. So See this guy up here. He's honestly he's a real OG um, he, Yeah, he found our dog. That's what happens when you go to Detroit people find your dog So start going to Detroit kids because people will find your dog <laughs> Don't question my intelligence. I am not short. I am not short. I am not short. Yes, you are. So I've come to a conclusion. We've been driving for literally like 10 minutes now. And I've come to the conclusion that this dog just likes going to other people's houses. That's all she's doing. Because... Uh, does anybody want a dog? So, dude, these guys are literally, we're probably going to get murdered, dude. They're so far back. Are we going to get murdered? I don't know. Hopefully they get murdered. Allie first. wants us to get murdered because she's like, that'd be so first. hot. You know that she has a thing for Ted Bundy? Like, she okay, has a, no she has a pic. No, you have a picture of him on your wall. No, and you I say, do not. Yeah, most girls have Justin Bieber. Allie has no. Ted Bundy. No. Yeah, no. you sick fuck. No. So, uh, we found you, you little fucking shit. Literally two and a half miles how the fuck did you manage to do that, Betty? Look at him. Literally, we opened the door. Betty's already ready, ready to fucking run off again. This one's humping her. Stop hump. You're both girls. What do you want? Can you grab the food and the, my purse? You want me to do everything? Well, Betty, I'm glad you're home. I'm gonna go relax now. I've been up since really early today. So if you could do me a favor, don't fuck off. Okay? And tell everybody to buy that merch. Or not. Okay, I find you and you don't tell them to buy the merch. Hey, cool.